So today, we have Captain America taking on the man who broke the bat, Bane. Who wins? Let's find out. So, Steve Rogers went through, or was given the super soldier serum that gave him super strength, speed, durability, stamina, reflexes, and agility. He's strong enough to lift two tons. He can run 13 miles in 30 minutes. He can easily dodge bullets, but not like using his reflexes like other bullet dodgers but because he sees the bullets coming and dodge out of the way. He's durable enough to survive bullet wounds, stabs, falls from great heights, and br from great heights, and brush it off like it was nothing. He's, he's in the top five best fighters in the MCU, being military trained, knowing many fighting styles, and creating his own fighting style that perfectly uses his shield. Speaking of, his only weapon is his vibranium shield. It's virtually indestructible, and he can use it like a frisbee and bounce it off walls to hit his opponents from the side or the back. It's known as the best offensive and defensive weapon. He's a fantastic strategist and tactician. He's the founding member and leader of the Avengers, and he's known as the next stage in human evolution, being the physical pinnacle of what any man could be one day. And in the other corner, we have Bane. Born to serve the life sentence of his father, Bane created a super steroid venom that enhanced his physical attributes and gave him a nice healing factor. He can also increase the dosage of this venom, which would increase his physicality and increase the speed of his healing factor. If he injects a large enough dosage, he'll have a heart attack, though, as that's happened before, and it's too much strain on his heart. His average strength allows him to lift over two tons, his max was 15 times right before he had a heart attack. Uh, he's durable enough to the point where bullets only do artificial damage. And he has a nice healing factor to heal from it as well. Uh, despite his size, he's a genius. He created this ven venom. He also found out Batman was Bruce Wayne in less than a year with little evidence. He's a formidable hand-to-hand -hand combatant using his enhanced strength and endurance, along with boxing, judo, and wrestling techniques. In prison, he was undefeated even without the venom. He's a master tactician and strategist, and he's known as the man who broke the bat as he killed the bat Batman by breaking his back. So, physically, it's hard to say. Even on his first dosage, Bane is for sure takes durability due to his healing factor, and I even say he's stronger too. Captain America has him slightly beaten uh, everywhere else though, but Bane can increase his physicality with his dosage, by increasing his dosage. Uh, but Captain America is for sure the better fighter, but Bane is no slouch by any means. So Captain America, he's the better fighter. At first, he's better physically, except for strength and durability, and he has a vibranium shield as his weapon. Bane, he's stronger, he's more durable due to his healing factor, and can increase his physicality. So, Captain America's greater skill will play a role, but not a big one, as Bane killed Batman, who's far better skilled than he is. Captain America will land more blows due to his greater speed and agility, and with his vibranium shield, he'll do damage, but Bane will just heal from it. Bane won't be able to really hurt Cap unless he separates him from his shield, which he's more than capable of doing. He can also simply overpower Cap, but he has to catch him first. <clears throat> the longer this fight goes, the more pissed off Bane will get and will increase his dosage, <clears throat> giving him the physicality advantage. But Cap will be able to stay in this fight. Let's look at when Bane killed Batman. Bruce was exhausted when they started fighting. That's the only reason why Bane won. Captain America isn't exhausted and he has more stamina than Batman. This is why I believe Captain America wins. I think he can last until Bane has a heart attack due to his high dosage or Cap could use his shield to break the tubes on Bane's back, knocking him out. Captain America wins. Like and subscribe. All the great stuff.